It's Ross Davis on the check-in when we got the top 10 rap lyrics that just didn't make sense. I woke up about that coma 2001, about the same time Dre dropped 2001. So the game says he woke out that coma 2001, about the same time Dre dropped 2001. Now, the game, I don't think he knows, but Dr. Dre dropped the album 2001 back in 1999. And for him to wake out of his coma in 2001, around the same time as the album in 1999, no. It's a two year difference. This line is obviously a lie, but he later on admitted that, you know, this line was fabricated. He was never in a coma. Famous. My apologies, are you into astrology? Cause um, I'm trying to make it to Uranus. And astrology is the study of the effects of suns and planets that they have on people in relation to their zodiac sign. That's more so what astrology is. So obviously Kanye mixed up astrology with astronomy here. 38 revolve like the sun round the earth. Try to play hard, get you found round the dirt. Now, Jay-Z claimed that he didn't graduate high school, and I know I ain't the brightest light in the ceiling, but I do know one thing, that the sun does not revolve around the earth, because, you know, the earth revolves around the sun, and I believe it takes, what, 366 days to do so, and I know they say school's not important, but sometimes, sometimes it is. Yeah, Chameleon Air says he's all about them horizontal lines through the S's, but dollar signs have a vertical line that goes up and down. Horizontal lines go left and right. I get it. You know, I think he just confused it too. This is on the original version of Still Tipping with Mike Jones, Slim Thug, and Chameleon Air, which he's later replaced by Paul Wall and they changed the beat. And this may be why. Riding in that coupe with the wings yeah. Going to your land with them chains yeah. Now I know I ain't the sharpest tool in the cabinet neither But Quavo was straight wildin' with this line You know, chinks is an insult to Chinese people And you know, he says he's flying to Thailand with some chinks And China and Thailand are two totally different countries And chinks is an insult towards Chinese people now, maybe it's an insult towards all Asians. I don't really know, but I imagine it's kind of like calling a Puerto Rican guy a wetback, even though they're both Hispanic, you know, it's just two different, whatever. Got introduced to Islam, started making a lot. When you're two different cities, Minnesota and Philly. But yeah, it's out of the freeway, but Minnesota's a state. Now, I understand why he might have thought that that was a city, because I ain't going to lie to you. Hey, I know a lot of them states in the Midwest, like the Upper West and all that, we tend to scrunch them all together and, you know, not really care about them. But, you know, <laughs> that's a whole state. And, you know, obviously Philadelphia is a city in Pennsylvania. So. Call me a camel, but I'm asking the trout. What the fin animal? Half man, half mammal. Yeah, this Jay-Z line just doesn't make sense. He says, I'm an animal, half man, half mammal. In case y'all don't know, mammals are just species with hair. So when he says he's half man, which humans and men are mammals, this line just doesn't make sense. And be honest with you, I don't even know where he was getting at with it. Don't forget about Christmas, nigga, because you ain't going to even see New Year. You heard? Yeah, Master P said, if you don't bring me back my money or my dope, forget Christmas. You ain't gonna see New Year's. I ain't gonna lie, it sounded hard when he said it, but I think he meant to say, forget New Year's, you ain't gonna see Christmas. Like, that just makes a little bit more sense, seeing as Christmas comes before New Year's. Just think if I empty the clip and he killed me, would I still be living with my homeboys miss me? Now, the answer to this is pretty simple. You would be dead if I emptied the clip and killed you. Now, mind you, a clip is what goes into like a rifle, a magazine's what goes inside of a pistol. So yeah, some people might survive a whole magazine, you know, possibly, but a whole clip, yeah. My paragraph alone 
alone is worth five mics. Uh -huh. A 12 song LP that's 36 mics. Uh -huh. Redman said, my paragraphs alone are worth five mics. So if he dropped a 12 track LP, that would be 36 mics. Now, I'm not the best at math here, and he had been high as hell when he wrote this. But anyway, let's go along with it. So basically, a paragraph is what, four sentences or more? So if uh, one paragraph is worth five mics, let's just break it down to two sentences. So two sentences would be worth what, two or three mics? And you know, if you times that by 12 tracks, that would be two sentences per tracks. Yeah, y'all, y'all, y'all see where I'm getting at, and even that sounds absolutely stupid of what I was even trying to rationalize with this bullshit. And there goes my top ten list of rap lyrics that didn't make sense. This is a part two. If y'all like to see the original video, check out my top six rap lyrics that didn't make sense on my Bryce Davis Media channel. And one thing I definitely learned by doing these lists is rappers just gotta stay away from calculating in their lyrics beat. That's all. But anyway, if you like the video, make sure you like and subscribe. 